What made you choose Yorkshire? Was it a historic reason? Not really. I used to go there as a girl, and of course, it's beautiful. Do you have any English blood? It's true, we only date from the 1850s, but Lady Cinderbiss family arrived in the reign of King Richard III. Really? I always think of you as nomads drifting around the world. Talking of drifting around, is it true you're starting your honeymoon at the Melfords in Coningsby? Yes. Oh, yes. Lady Melford is mother's cousin. Is she? I never knew that. I gather you wanted a synagogue blessing. I'd like to respect both sides. Well, you don't understand our customs. Then again, why should you? So it won't be possible? No. He should have told you. I thought we could have a dinner on Wednesday night for all of you. So you could meet some of the relations. And show them how lucky they are. <laughs> <laughs> Have you got many of them staying? We're crammed to the gunnels. Atticus has had to move into the Hornby Hotel. <laughs> I love the Hornby. It makes sense, and he can have his... What do they call it now? His stag party there, uh -huh. without disturbing us. <laughs> Will you be going, Lord Cinderby? <laughs> Hardly. Stag parties are rather high on Father's disapproval list. <laughs> Is it a long list, Lord Cinderby? The things you disapprove of? No. As long as I can steer clear of card sharps and undercooked fish. <laughs> and divorce. I think I'm fairly easy. Is divorce so terrible these days? Is it worse to stay together and be miserable? Well, I'm clearly old-fashioned, but to me, divorce signifies weakness, degradation, scandal, failure. Are you glad to be in London again? I will be when I get the house back. When do the tenants go? Next week, in theory. I need to pull the real pictures out of storage. What a palaver. <laughs> I know, but think of the relief when I can shut the door at last and be alone in my own home. Won't Lord Flincher be in there with you? Of course he will. Of course I will. What a funny thing to say, Susan. Well, can you use one word for it? Well, I want you to know that you'll always be welcome at Canningford. How kind. Tell me, do you find it difficult these days to get staff? Not very, but then we're Jewish, so we pay well. <laughs>